Hi guys! We're at the gondola. Here in Kicking Horse. Yes, Kicking Horse. Okay. <laughs> I hope we don't get I hope we don't get stuck again. We're not gonna get stuck. And guys, uh again. <laughs> we can see the the whole we're going up to the mountain. I don't know why. Yeah. And how many degrees? Oh, I said five. Five. Right to the top. Right to the top. where I'm going I'm not scared I'm just like yeah. just looking back I'm not scared either. That's like I like your eyes for the bears here you can find them well, where is the bear <laughs> actually guys uh, if you look out for the wildlife you can see some uh, bear down downstairs. underneath <laughs> underneath <laughs> sometimes uh, yeah do the, sometimes the bear is taking a bath there in the yeah, what? some bear are taking a bath in the lake. Okay, but why are we saying a bear to... taking a bath? Oh, yeah. yeah. So and guys, uh, float above the clouds as you are whisked to 7,700 feet. Take in panoramic views of the Rocky Mountains, the Columbia River, wetlands, and the town of Golden. And during the journey, we can spot um, wildlife and perhaps even a glimpse of Kicking Horse Mountain Resort resident Grizzly Bear and they call it Boo So in guys, uh, access via single scenic gondola ride, the Kicking Horse Bike Park offers one-of-a-kind alpine riding, offering all types of trail, an alpine meadow surrounded by majestic mountains vistas. So in guys, uh, we are at the top of the mountain now, and it says here it's Crystal Bowl, Kicking Horse Mountain Resort, and Then guys, people don't come to uh, Kicking Horse Mountain Resort to ride the same old thing. They come for the differences and they have plenty. What this means is over 3,700 feet of variety. The start of it is the view from the Alpine Lounge which is dominated by the three mountain ranges 
that surround the park and the wetlands of the Colombia Valley. From there, it is all downhill where the wow factor is amplified by multiple berms, jumps, wooden features, stick rack has to be ridden and to be believed. Rock slabs look directly below to the gondola to see the longest and plenty of good old white knuckle single track. And the only thing missing is crowds. But we suspect we won't mind it. Once at the summit, 
venture forth on a hike or simply soak up the endless mountain vistas from on top of the world or visit the Eagle's Eye restaurant for lunch or snack and keep an eye for the wildlife in the alpine terrain. After all, at the end of gondola ride is simply the start of your next adventure. Thank you so much for watching and see you in my next vlog. Bye-bye. Thank you.